It was a unique house. Tucked away on a hill in McGuanago. There was a lot of potential for our family. That potential burned down Sunday afternoon. I was a firefighter for 10 years and always cared about everybody else's house. When I saw my own, I didn't. It was heartbreaking. Smoke and heavy flames could be seen for miles. Retired firefighter Greg Jablonowski says he had just left his home. I checked the fireplace, made sure the door was closed. Then he got the call. When I got back, it was already fully engulfed. Jablonowski says the fire started in the kitchen. It rose all the way up from the ceilings and took over the entire house. He says the only thing that was salvageable was the garage. Jablonowski's wife and kids weren't home. And I tried to save them. And it was on fire in the back, so I couldn't get to him fast enough. Their dog, Diesel, didn't make it. He always protected everybody. Jablonowski served his community for decades. Now that community is returning the favor. Every time I look at my phone, I cry because I can't believe it. Family friends created a GoFundMe page, sent donations of clothes, and are offering ways to get them back on their feet. It's been unbelievable. <laughs> I never thought anybody would just help us like that. The family plans to rebuild. <sighs> the little things get them through. We found my old fire badge, so my son wanted to keep it. And he's been wearing it every day since. In McGuanago, Spencer Tracy, Fox 6 News.